But this is five dollars. This would have been like three dollars a dunkin'. Lobby has already put out a lot of their Christmas stuff and they still have a lot of summer stuff that's still out and it is not marked down. So, so I don't know what they're going to do because it is, what is this? Sep no, this is August, almost September at this point. And they usually have their Christmas stuff out at this point by now. Um, and they have all this summer stuff and none of it's marked down, so. They do have a lot of, like, outdoor furniture that's on clearance, but it's only 50% off. This late in the summer, this stuff should be, like, 75% off. But I do get it because they lost a lot of business and shipments and stuff were really slow due to COVID. Um, but, yeah. Uh, come back when it's 75% off. Y'all, these wreaths are like astronomically priced. I'm gonna turn the camera around so y'all can see, but some of these wreaths are like, let me see. Well, that one's $20. Uh, I just saw one that was like $69. I was like, absolutely for freaking not. How much is this one? Yeah, it, it was 20 I'm like, girl. In what world are we spending 60 70 dollars for a damn wreath? What's the 
get it or like this one is 50. I guess that's decent. Well, yeah, I can do a wreath myself. Like, I can't be paying that much for no wreath. And that's so easy to do. Like, they're so easy to do. There's no excuse to spend 50 or 60 dollars on a wreath unless you just, like, girl, I don't care about doing it. I'd rather pay. So happy Wednesday. I'm on my lunch hour. So I'm about to head to um, Ross and TJ Maxx to see if I can find some stuff to decorate for fall. For some reason this year. Sorry. I gotta find my car keys. For some reason this year I want to decorate four. Oh. And of course, I have no stuff to check on with. So. Okay, so hopefully, I can find some stuff because I've been looking. And, um, whew, there it's been like slim pickings. So there's a uh, Ross, a TJ Maxx, and then a Big Lots. So I know if I can't find anything in those two, Big Lots would definitely have some stuff. Maybe I should start with Big Lots again. Eh, we'll see. Okay. Bye. Okay, so I'm in at TJ Maxx and I do have a few things in here. I went to Ross first. Child, they didn't have crap. So hopefully I can pick up some stuff in here for my porch at least. We will see, honey. This is really pretty. Hey you guys, happy Friday. Um, I'm on my lunch hour. I'm about to get to Dollar Tree because I'm still on the hunt for Decor. Um, specifically, I need a ribbon, and um, I think I'm gonna pick up a couple of little pumpkins. I don't know why this year I'm like so determined to decorate for fall, but I am. So we got to head to Dollar Tree to see if they have. First of all, if they have anything that's even stocked, because a lot of these stores have been uh, short staffed like really short staff so <laughs> hopefully they don't have a thousand boxes just sitting around and no one to stock stock anything but we shall see and hopefully I have some looking fine and some ribbon because I want to make a few bowls for my I want to make one for my door hanger and then I want to make one for oh uh, no I want to make two for my uh, lanterns that are on my porch I bought some new lanterns from Walmart, which I saw in the last vlog. So, child, we, we're going to pray that I can find some stuff. Because honestly, I'm tired of going to stores at this point. Um, and this is probably going to be my last store run. And we're just going to have to roll with whatever I got. But yeah, see y'all in a little bit. Tell me you need me, 
But I'm from a city that's high school I give them the cinema, I go uh, Cause you a bad man, if she don't love man If she break grass real fast like con man Wanna swim down to the deep end Wanna know all my secrets, honestly Can you Okay, we are at the second location. I did pick up two placemats and they had some really pretty, um, some really pretty plates in there. They had some lean plates and they had some um, pumpkin plates. But all I did, I just picked up, oh, and they also had some really cute, uh, like tumblers and um, coffee cups. Um, but I just picked up a couple of placemats because I'm gonna make like little pillows out of those but they didn't have any they had ribbon but they only had mesh so I don't need mesh but we got to go in here and see what they got oh they have ribbon I'm so excited and these are really cute like I want to do a thousand DIYs and then half of them get done half of them are halfway done and none of them get done at all um so this weekend I want to paint the door I'm in the process of doing a door hanger a, a wood round door hanger and decorating my porch for fall those are the things I want to get accomplished this weekend and it's Labor Day weekend so I don't go back to work till Wednesday actually um, so, I'm just on the way to get Caleb, and then I'm on the way home. Hopefully, I can get this door sanded down and finish this door hanger today. Too bad, I've been sticking on your mind. I know you like your hair, I'm from your head. I know you stand here, how you taking all my time. That's right, can you take it? Spaghetti for breakfast? Mm -hmm. I'm doubtful. Or did you have sausage and biscuit? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I think Ross, oh, Ross may be open, so I'm about to stop at Ross. But yesterday we went to the Delta Fair, y'all. My feet. Oh, I forgot Kirkland's is over here. My feet hurt so bad because I wore sandals. And the sandals, don't get me wrong, they're comfortable. As in like comfortable to go to work in, comfortable to walk around in. But they are not for our walking on concrete um, types of shoes. And I quickly learned that yesterday. Like my feet were on fire like oh my god my feet hurt so bad <laughs> i literally came home got undressed immediately took a amazingly hot shower and i was just wore out I, I, <sighs> yeah I, I, no 
I was somewhere else. <sighs> anyway, wherever else. Hopefully, they have something that's worth it in here. I don't know. Where. Purchase those spirits because those spirits were a really good deal. They were, um, what, 64 $62.99, I think. So they were like 65 with tax. Like, yeah, I purchased those quickly. Anybody who has ever, like, bought spirits or looked into buying spirits know that they can run from a hundred to 150 depending on even more depending on um the style Whew. so now i'm on the way to home goods um that was the only thing i found in ross like ross is so very very much hit and miss especially the ones here so i don't know where ross is y'all be shopping at i see your little ross hauls i see you shop with me at ross and i'm like girl what ross is this <sighs> okay, now I'm gonna head to Home Goods. Hopefully, they have this fall piece that I want. And um, do I need to go to Costco while I'm out here? I don't think I do. No, I'm not gonna go to Costco because I'll be spending unnecessary money that. I don't need to spend. I just spent $60 at one point. I'll spend it on some freaking shoes. So, to home goods we go. This is pretty. Oh, it lights up too. Okay, this is what I'm in here for. Let's see, this one is missing one of the um, things. So hopefully they have one that actually had all the pieces. And hopefully I can uh, get that one. This is cute. These are pretty. Even if you try, you wouldn't understand it. Maybe something's missing inside of you. Just a bit of sugar to that hobby bitter. Maybe you taste different. Hold up, hold up, baby. I can sit beside you while you're going on about your simple life. Nothing left you thinking that maybe you're not different Go on, blab your ego Guess what? They had it. They actually still had both of them. So I'm gonna get them one. And I'm gonna get this table runner. So pretty. And that's it. That's all I'm getting out of here. I'm not getting anything else, I promise.
Pumpkin spice latte grande. You said a Vinci pumpkin spice latte? Uh, grande. Oh, grande. Okay. What else for you? Um, that is it. You said that was all? That's it. All right. 576. Thank you. spice head person like I'm not one of people who are like oh my god I can't wait for the pumpkin spice no I get it occasionally I rarely first of all I rarely go to Starbucks for coffee because honestly it's just overpriced um I usually like to stop at Dunkin but the Dunkin Donuts out here is like all the way down the other end of the street and I wasn't driving it far but yeah I usually go to Dunkin because there's one um near my job so, if I'm going to get coffee from anywhere, it'll be either McDonald's or uh, Dunkin'. And honestly, Dunkin' is, dare I say it, I like Dunkin' better. And they're cheaper. This is $5. This would have been like $3 at Dunkin'. The, and, and it would taste sick. Just as good. Sorry. Sorry, Starbucks. Sorry, Starbucks. Ooh, Starbucks. <laughs> Sorry, Starbucks, but it's the truth. Like, girl, first of all, y'all expensive and y'all overhyped. I said it. I said what I said. But I'm about to drink this coffee because I need it. <laughs> 